who could officially tattoo with ballpoint pen cartridges. I know back in the day you had to jerry-rig it a little bit with a pen, had the tube go through, and it's a big nightmare. Now there's a lot of options. You have Apentis cartridges, you have Illumino hard ink cartridges, you also have Sweet Tooth. So thankfully, these brands were really cool. They all sent me some cartridges to try out. All three of these brands are really cool. All of them I've talked to personally. They're great people. And I think that the important thing to take away from this is that there's options now. Whether it's Apentis cartridges, whether it's Illumino or Sweet Tooth, these are all great options. I'm just going to let you know the difference between all three of them and you know, you might pick one up. I would honestly try picking all of them up. They are all different and they all offer you something differently. I'll start off with the first one I tried. I tried Sweet Tooth. I reached out to them on Instagram. They have a really, really cool online presence. They do their promotion really differently. They have cool horror movies. They do cool art. They have a lot of integral things when it comes to art, when it comes to spooky stuff. And stippling kind of fits in with like a lot of horror and gothic things. So initially, that's what caught my eye is that the style of promoting they do and the type of art that they show their artwork on with their cartridges. Each cartridge is about $10. I know it's three of them for $30. They are all 3D printed. They come in purple, black, and other colors. They are $30 for a little box like this. I believe it comes in three. Sometimes I know companies as they expand, sometimes their prices change, but at the time of recording this, that's how much they are. They are 3D printed. They are very nice. The biggest thing that they offer is different ergonomic designs. There's rigid ones, there's more diamond shaped ones. There's a lot of different options if you're someone that wants a nice grip. However, I did find myself just using the grip on my tattoo machine as that's what I'm most comfortable with. They are really good, they are really nice. $30 for three. $10 each. Illumino Inc. is the next brand I wanted to try out. They had a different presence. It was very much a professional, kind of hipstery, and I mean that in like a sincere way. It's very home learning. It's very cool. It's very calm. There's a nice aesthetic they have with their social media. It's very calming. If you ever check them out on Instagram, you'll know what I mean. I love the packaging as well as the Sweet Tooth. Very different packaging. There's art all around it. There is a lot of little detail in everything. At the time of this recording and my usage of it, I've used up all these cartridges. They now have colored cartridges, which those are really nice. 10 cartridges runs you $24.99, while four cartridges runs you $14.99. The $14.99 is the regular ones, and the $24.99 are the colored packs. Very different packaging, offers you very different things. These are more like the traditional cartridges that you would use when you're tattooing. These are more of a cool 3D print type of project. They're really nice. They're really cool. They're not close to cartridges. However, they are very different, and I think that's because of the grip. There's no valve, which I'm not sure if that makes a difference, honestly, when it comes to ballpoint pen cartridges. These do. These are very similar to a real cartridge. These are different as like a toy. Mosu Ink is pretty phenomenal, honestly. I saw Tyler Tattoos do a review on them, and I thought, you know, that's pretty insane. I didn't think that there was other brands that were making them. Bosu had a really good following, phenomenal reviews. Someone I actually know is reviewing them. I decided to reach out and I was sent red, pink, blue, black. I was sent every color that they have. All of them were phenomenal. They're all plastic and they're actually close to a cartridge. However, they're very small. They're a lot smaller than your average cartridge. However, they're not meant to be used on human skin. These are $35 for 20 of them. That's coming in at the cheapest option out of the three. Given that they're not 3D printed, I'm not sure how they make them. Same thing as in Lumino. They're very different, and you can tell all of them make their cartridges different from each other, and they're very nice. I did use up all the cartridges that I was given for this for the reviews and to use and learn with. So technically, I learned using Sweet Tooth. I started to get better with Lumino, and then I actually was able to do pretty good art with Mosu, but I can't say that this is better or that Mosu is necessarily better or Sweet Tooth because I learned all the way through this. I learned all the way through this and then this I was able to have fun with and learn. So in regards to what's the best one, I think that depends on your price point and I think that depends on what style of cartridges you want to use. If you want something that's really close to a real cartridge and that's comfortable, I'd say Illumino. If you want something that's really cheap, you have a bunch of different colors and it's something that's fun, I would say Apentis by Mosu. Or if you want something pretty cool like a toy and has a lot of different ergonomic designs on it and it's really nice and cool and it's creative, I'd say Sweet Tooth. I think all three of these brands have a home for somebody. I don't think any of them are necessarily better. Some of them are more expensive than others. My favorite way to use all of these cartridges was to use a low stroke machine. I used the Ambition Mars when the Mars came out and then the Mars U once they updated it. I really enjoyed using the lower stroke eventually flicking out to a higher stroke to get nice densities and gradients. I think that's the best way to use 
ballpoint pen tattoo cartridges. That's my favorite way. It might not be your favorite way, but I think that these cartridges are really great. I think you should definitely give them a try. You can learn stuff, you can practice, you can do stuff without tattooing people. And if you're someone that isn't a tattoo artist that has a tattoo machine and you want to make stipple art and you don't want to do every dot at a time, perfect option. Each of these brands will have links in the description below. That way you can check them out. They are great. I have awesome art that I've made with them. I really enjoy teaching people how to use them and you can't go wrong. It's not that expensive, honestly, in the grand scheme of things. If you want to learn how to do stipple work, it's not a one-for-one -one on real skin, but it is very, very close. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you had a great day. Please check them out.